Continuing coverage now, the attorneys for the woman accused of killing a six-year-old Harahan girl, then stuffing her body in a chlorine container back in court this morning. WGNO Zach Lobby is live with the latest. Zach. Hey, good morning, Amy. Well, Boonock Landon was not in court today, but attorneys are now requesting that a former attorney of Landon's be subpoenaed to appear in court because they may have information about how police were able to locate a cell phone. So Boonock Landon is accused of murdering six-year-old Bella Fontenelle, and that uh, and is facing two counts of obstruction of justice charges and first degree murder charges. Landon is accused of strangling the child before stuffing her body in a bucket, leaving it on the child's mother's front lawn. Later, allegedly, she buried her phone in a neighbor's yard after searching online for defense attorneys. Today, attorneys met over a motion filed by prosecutors requesting a subpoena for attorney Christian Bonin, who represented Landon in a prior misdemeanor case. According to the motion, Landon's sister had emailed Bonin detailing where Landon buried the phone. Bonin then contacted police. Prosecutors are arguing that Bonin's testimony is crucial to piecing together the story of how the phone was located and to ensure that it was seized legally. And now the defense is asking for what's called a contradictory hearing to determine if such information is even admissible in court. Now the judge has set a date for that contradictory hearing. That's going to be March 7th, next Thursday. And she says they are asking that Bonin appear in court voluntarily and they plan on moving forward either way. But we, of course, will keep you up to date with the latest on air and online at WGNO.com. For now, back to you. Thanks so much for that update, Zach.